It was June of 2009. The Sneevils had just invaded Badalon and Quibble had arrived for the second time. I was in game one day just minding my own business when I received a PM from a player that said, Hey do you want ACs? Now Quibble had these really cool looking Spartan items and I really wanted them. But there was one problem, they costed ACs and I was a poor 11 year old kid who didn't have any. So I replied to the player and we ended up in a private battle on. They said that in order to give me the ACs, they were going to need my password. Big surprise, right? Initially I hesitated, but then they said something along the lines of Come on it gives you 2k ACs. And well, I really did not want to miss out on that Spartan stuff. So I gave them my password. And shortly after, they told me to relog. So I logged out, typed in my account info, and I got a message saying that my password was wrong. Now at this point, I knew I messed up. I tried to reset my password, but it turned out that I never actually confirmed my email address. And, I didn't know that player support was a thing at the time. So as far as I knew, I was not getting that account back. I quit the game after that, but I still continued to play Dragon Fable throughout the summer. My time away from AQW didn't last long though. Near the end of the summer, I decided to log back in on my alt account for seemingly no reason. And at the time, the Dwarfhold Saga happened to be finishing up. I found out that the new Chaos Lord was a Dragon Lord, and well, being a fan of Dragon Fable, I thought that was pretty awesome. So I gave the game another go, and well, what was originally my alt account ended up becoming my main account, and I've continued to play the game ever since. So yeah, I learned an important lesson that day. Don't give out your password to anyone, because if you do, you definitely won't be getting those Spartan items. But whatever happened to the account I lost? Well, as the years went on, I became more involved with Discord. And on there, I met a guy who had also been scammed and hadn't confirmed the email address on their account either. However, they were able to get their account back. And they did that by contacting player support and providing them with as much information about the account as they could remember. So I did that. I contacted player support, told them what I remembered, and well, I got it. I got the account back. It only took me 8 years, but I got it back. Well, that's the story of how I got scammed and how I got my account back. Thank you player support, and thank you for watching. Have a nice day.